Hey y'all, I am starting this week in my life vlog. It's the first week of summer school and I'm taking three classes. I'm taking accounting 341, marketing 310, and women's studies 403, I think. Um, but it's like 10, 15 right now. And I have been doing homework since 8. We love the first day of class. But I have a doctor's appointment today. And then I um, have a lecture at 5. So yeah. <sighs> but not much is going on. But I thought I would document this week of my life since I haven't done one of those in a while. But yeah. It is Tuesday. I literally didn't film anything after I took the time lapse in the morning yesterday. I literally came home from the doctor and did homework and went to class and then we had chicken and fries in the air fryer. Which was cool because you can make like chicken tenders. But yeah, but now it's 2.30. Oh, and yesterday I went to the library because I went to get the last book of the book series I'm reading because I can't get it on my like the online library to read on my kindle until like two more weeks so i went to the library to get it but i had my first shadow shift at lulu today from nine to one yeah and then now i'm home and i need to start doing homework but i wanted to show you the shirt i got today at work I got the Earth Dye collection shirt. It's just the um, All Your Steve. I got it into six, so it's oversized. But I think I'm gonna wear it, because I work again on Friday. I think I'm gonna wear it with biker shorts. But I just wore the scuba half zip with a line crops. So, but I also got, um, Two of the shirts I ordered on Aritzia like a month ago were back ordered. So they're the one shoulder crop tops in these cool foam colors. And then the Lonely Ghost um, Drive Safe, different ways to say I love you, shirt restocked. So I bought it. So I got that. So yeah, we're just gonna get my life together, I guess. But today, Lollapalooza was announced. Uh, it's gonna be happening. Sorry, I'm like opening up things. Um, what's gonna be happening? Because I got the paper like screen protector for my iPad. Um, but so yeah, the lineup drops tomorrow. So I can't go all four days, which is sad. I can only go for the weekend if I get to go at all. So we will see. But me, I think all of my friends pretty much can only go on the weekend. So we may just do a one day or weekend thing. I don't know, we will see. So yeah, that's all I have to update y'all on. I'm about to go do some homework. So I'll check in later because no one wants to watch me read. So yeah, talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, so I have been the actual worst at trying to do this freaking week vlog. I'm just like really struggling at remembering to do it. Um, but today I woke up at 7 and then did homework until like 12.45 and then I got my first COVID shot. And then after that I got my hair cut and I literally just got trimmed so it looks not anything different. But we, I pranked my mom and my grandma that I chopped off my hair so that was fun like so 
Josh who cuts my hair also cuts my grandma's hair and so my grandma called the hair salon and was like, did you just chop off all my granddaughter's hair so that was fun and then I had class from 5 to 6 30 and then my grandma got me chick-fil-a because I was craving it and I don't even really like chick-fil-a that much I know unpopular opinion but I really wanted a milkshake and fries so I got a cookies and cream milkshake fries and a chicken sandwich I gotta finish this. I drank the half gal before noon and I'm just really struggling trying to get the rest of this half gal down. Um so yeah. But I can show you what I got from Amazon. Or not Amazon, Abercrombie. I got these shorts in a size six. They're just the cut off high rise shorts. These are cute, they actually cover my butt, which is, you know, fabulous. And then, okay, so I like don't own one pieces except the one that I wore for lifeguarding that says lifeguard across it. So I got this one piece because, okay, like you know the days where you're just like, not feeling like a bikini, like showing your whole freaking body to the world you know so i got this one even though it's kind of like low cut but it's so cute on love to see it love to see it so yeah it's like eight o'clock but i am freaking exhausted so i think i'm gonna start getting ready for bed but yeah i have some clothes to send back because I got another pair of shorts. I got another pair of shorts from Abercrombie and they're like the same style and everything, but they're just like the light color and I don't know why, but they fit different and I don't like them. So I'm gonna send those back. And then... But we're just chilling, not doing anything too exciting, but I'm breaking out, which is just so freaking fun. Love it for me. I'm not really surprised though. Um, yeah, I don't know. Also, um, I have a wedding to go to in September and I'm really struggling to find a dress. I don't know why and I'm literally down to wear a romper or a jumpsuit but like everything on the internet just is like really ugly right now I don't know and like it's like my family's wedding so I don't want to wear anything like low cut you know that's like not appropriate but like I really I kind of just I don't know I might just wear a freaking jumpsuit but I really want to do two braids like middle part two braids going back ponytail curled that's like the plan why am i planning this out so early i literally don't know but yeah tomorrow i'm really gonna do schoolwork. i'll bring you along for that i guess it's not gonna be too exciting though but I'm so excited because um, this weekend I think I'm having a slumber party with my friends. I'm really excited. Um, oh, okay. I don't know if I talked about this. Lollapalooza is happening. I think you talked about this yesterday, but today the lineup came out. And okay, the lineup's not bad, but like it's not as good as it has been. And I know it's because of like COVID and how last minute this is. But it's so like the people that I want to see are Olivia O'Brien, Post Malone, Miley Cyrus, Roddy Rich. I'm probably missing someone in there. But I like don't think I can go, like I was saying before besides to do like one or two days 
and I have a feeling that like post more of my Cyrus is gonna be like Thursday or Friday night, which I won't be able to go at all. So maybe going to Lollapalooza, may not be going to Lollapalooza. We'll just see. I'm not mad that I can't go all four days because I don't know if I even want to because there's not like I don't know. This is bad to say, but like I love going to Lollapalooza, but this lineup I just feel like isn't worth the four hundred dollars. I don't know if that's bad to say. Usually because like usually there's so many small artists that are going that I want to see and I feel like this lineup not really. Also the fact that Kendrick Lamar goes to every other Lollapalooza except the freaking Chicago one is really annoying. Um yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but all okay, I think I think the Canadian border is still closed. But I want to go to freaking Toronto. Yeah, it says Canada and the United States has agreed to extend the ban on non-essential travel between the United States and Canada through May 21st. So, I mean, maybe, but probably not because it keeps getting pushed back. I don't want to go to Toronto. I've never been. I've only been to the airport in Canada. Never anywhere else. But, yeah. I don't know. I also like, I feel like my life is so boring right now because I have nothing to do besides school and work. But if y'all are on hockey TikTok, or book talk, hockey TikTok, probably it's on both now. But the deal, the, off, the first off campus book, Garrett Graham. So, this boy who plays hockey, I don't even know his name, but everybody keeps tagging or keeps putting in his comments that he looks like Garrett Graham. And I disagree. I will always think that Garrett Graham looks like Jack Galinsky. I don't know why. Jack Galinsky doesn't even play hockey. I don't know. That's what my brain conjured up. John Logan, on the other hand, 110%. Matt Barzel. That, that's the final statement. Because I used to kind of think that Matt Barzel should be Garrett. Because like, I'm just like really picturing Garrett as like a tall, muscular brunette. If we're just gonna like cut it down to like plain Jane. And like, spiky hair like let me just let me just pull a picture i don't know why i'm ranting about this probably none of you care um but then i was thinking about their attitude and like just from like the interviews that i've watched i feel like matt barzel is john logan I could be wrong, but like, why can't I find a picture? Like this, like this is the hair that I'm envisioning for Gare Graham. Like, it, wasn't that called like a quiff at one point? Isn't that what, like, Niall Horan's hair was when, like, One Direction was first a thing? I don't know. But, I don't know. John Logan and, like, like Garrett Graham, like, if I had to put them in order, like, Garrett is number one and John is number two. Like, or Logan. That's so weird to call him John. Logan is number two. Him. As if he's real. <sighs> you see what these books do to me? Anyway. But, like, I would argue that both of them are number one for different reasons. I'm just saying. Dude, I'm really thinking about making like a book club YouTube video. 
every month and just like speak on the books I read because I can rant about them but I also don't like don't want to do that because I don't want to like spoil them because I have a really bad habit of being like you need to read this book and then explaining the whole book to them and then it's just like you don't even have to read it anymore because I just told you the entire thing A gallon finished. <sighs> now I need to fill it back up. Um, don't ask why I'm using this instead of my hydro jug. I couldn't really tell you. Because they're literally no different. It still has handle. This one's just like uh, thinner, like taller but thinner. I don't know, now that I've been rambling for 12 minutes. I should go. I also was on TikTok for, I'm not kidding, um, probably an hour and 45 minutes. It was horrible. Not good for me. I have an hour time limit on there. Like on all my social media, I only give myself an hour every day. Because during school, especially having it online, I was on my phone a lot and that's why I made myself have time limits and today I just ignored the one on TikTok. That's the one that I ignore the most. Like I never reach my hour on Twitter. I never, I very rarely reach my hour on Instagram and I never reach my hour on Facebook. But freaking TikTok man, I think it's just because it's mindless scrolling. I don't know. I do not know. I need to redo my nails because they are so chipped. I really want to get them done. I want, see this is more rambling. I just like can't stop talking. So, um, why am I blanking on her name? A couple weeks ago, she had these like super cute, please focus, smiley face nails. That's what I want. You'll see if that happens. I need to fill this up and get ready for bed because I want to read my book before I go to sleep and I'm so tired and I need to wake up tomorrow to do school. Good morning, y'all. It's like 10 o'clock. I've been up since like 8-ish. I'm setting all my Gatorade if it will stay. Um, but I'm gonna do some homework. Hopefully get it done early so that I can read because I have library books I need to read to bring back on time. So I have to do my accounting homework and my marketing homework. So let's get the dang thing done. Because I get my marketing homework done, all the homework I have for marketing next week is my exam. Which is nice. Because I think my exam's on Friday. Yeah. Cool. Alright. We're gonna get down to it. Talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, I look <laughs> kind of scary, but I just got off my shift at Lulu. It was so much fun. Like, I, it was so much fun. I worked from 2 to 7. So it's 7, 7, 10 right now. Um, but it was so much fun. I got to work with, like, people that I haven't worked with before. And Veronica was there, who's, like, my best BFF. Like, love her. <laughs> um, but now I'm heading home. Um, a quiz this morning i feel so bad that this week on vlog like kind of sucks but like i'm still gonna upload it because it's kind of fun that i like started my first um lulu shift but i wore biker shorts which is like not for me like never wear biker shorts kind of loved it kind of loved the vibe also um look at my shoes the sickest whatever um but like i'm kind of like hyped up now and i haven't eaten since 12 and i'm like not hungry and i think it's just because it's hot like i think that's like the only reason but I'm going home now. Yeah. 
Hey y'all, I realized that I never ended off this vlog yesterday after work. I literally came home, talked to my mom and grandma about work because it was <laughs> fun and I got to meet a lot of people. Um, and then I had dinner and then read and went to bed. It wasn't like super crazy, but it was a good night. I was kind of tired from walking around at work, but like a good tired. But yeah so thank y'all for watching this week in my life even though it's kind of a fail i just want to like document my life you know but i think i'm gonna start a weekend vlog now so stay tuned for that if you liked it please like and subscribe i put out new content every sunday